dear friend. <laughs> you write. I reckon I won't. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is the right time, but uh, I'd like you to know. Uh, Carolyn and I. Yes. Uh, yeah. It's the nicest farewell gift I could imagine. <laughs> Ready to face Doris? As I'll ever be. <laughs> Miss Adams, Miss Adams, when Alma told me you were leaving, I said, no, dear, that's quite impossible. Miss Adams is one of us, but she left me with no choice but to believe. Your husband, I hear, alive. Yes. I mean, no disrespect, but how is it possible to mislay a husband? I've enjoyed knowing you, Mrs. Collins. Oh, you go to him, Miss Adams. Go to him and bring him home to us. This is your home now. I wish I could. Sensitivity for poor Mr. Bly, I understand. But I'm going to say au revoir, not goodbye, in the hope that we do meet again. You can't leave us. Oh, girls, now decorum. <laughs> We've come to say goodbye. Livy's relocating to the city until the tension subsides. How is your father? Trying to be strong. I'll be with him. Don't worry. Good. You saved me. Twice. Two reasons I'm glad I came into your lives. Whatever happens, I hope it brings happiness. And you. I'm sure you'll be a wonderful mother. I hope so. Take care.